you need a beer bomb, baby. I'm Tiffany, this is RJ, and welcome to our review of the Fisher Price Cradle and Swing. This is specifically the Fisher Price Snugga Monkey Cradle and Swing that we bought in store at Target. So I'm listing the pros, cons, and was the buy worth it? The number one pro for this swing is the newborn insert. I know you may be thinking, but Tiffany, a lot of swings come with a newborn insert. Yes, but not everything that shines is gold. Before this swing, for a brief time, we had this. The Graco Duet Connect LX Multi-Direction Baby Swing and Bouncer. Whew. It's another swing at Target that had a bulk of great reviews. We got it when RJ was a few weeks old and used its newborn insert, but it pushed his neck forward to his chest, which is a safety no-no. And being a new parent, you are nervous about everything, so you don't want to wing it when you could just get something that safely does the job. The Fisher-Price newborn insert here worked. Baby was comfortable and safe. Pro. The sound option on this swing is a gold star. It has different options from lullabies to nature sounds, plus great volume control from a gentle hush to loud enough to use for white noise. And background noise can make a world of difference when you're talking about babies and sleep. Pro. The electric mobile is great interaction for babies who aren't quite at the playing stage yet. RJ loved watching the mobile circle and seeing the baby in the mirror. The Graco model we had just had a stationary one that basically just swayed with the swing. Pro. The seat can change from upright to reclined. In the sitting position, RJ can still check out everything happening around him, but in the early days, if we were sneaking in a meal, RJ would sneak in a nap in the recline position. Pro, you can change the speed of the swing. I love that there is this option on the swing where you can go from a gentle rock to a full swing. The first three are great for lulling baby to sleep or getting RJ relaxed. Con. The biggest downfall of this swing is that it later started having its moments where it was hard to turn on, as seen here. I looked up reviews and did see some complaints of a similar kind, but to be honest, every swing we saw on Target's website had a few reviews saying technical issues. So we picked the one with the least cases, but still we were one of the unlucky ones that got the sticky switch. Yeah, we could send it in for a new one, but honestly, I didn't feel like doing all of that, especially when one reviewer said they sent it in and the new swing they received had the same problem. Con, the headrest material can be rough on hair. I learned a thin hair spot is a common issue for some babies before they start rolling over because the back of their head rubs against whatever they're laying on. But I noticed RJ wasn't sleeping on his back anymore and the hair still wasn't getting thick but it did start to grow when we stopped using the swing. Con. I felt this swing outgrew its usefulness fast. When RJ was a newborn, this was amazing. After carrying him around or wearing him in a sling all day, this was heaven sent when I just wanted to be off my feet and have both hands free. But when RJ started being more independent and interested in grabbing things, I wanted him to have more freedom. Target's website says the swing's weight max is 25 pounds and babies can be in it until they try to climb out, which is around nine months. But around four to six months with RJ, he started moving on to bigger and better things. And the swing is now on its way to being put up in storage for the next baby. Would I get this again? Yeah. It does the job, even if it has some things that annoy us, but it's safe and still its annoyances are better than other swings at a similar price point. Now that I know better, I would have kept the packaging and receipts to send it back in just for the hope they could send me one without the switch issue. Thanks for watching and make sure to share this video and subscribe to our channel. We make new videos every Wednesday. Thanks and see you soon.